Yo, hi everybody, this is AB. So I'm here today in Slough, and this is probably the last decent thing you will see in this video. <laughs> yeah, welcome to Slough. Trust me, this town is a tip. So, just arrived here, got no uh, plan really. I'm just, uh, I'm here for the day, so I'm just gonna walk around and film. Let's do this. I just noticed uh, Halifax uh, got a power cut. So I think it's a bit funny. So let's film. Francis Cookie Close, sorry for. They said Parker there. Well, they got Parker. Yeah, no money. Yeah. Well, that's interesting. I reckon they ran off without money. What's going on? What's happening? Why? Power cut? Everywhere? Oh! So where's the money? <laughs> yeah, these guys got power. We've got power. It's just them. So, Halifax done the runner. With our money. <laughs> to be honest, I'm back to them. Yeah, they're lying. Say that again. Yeah, the lights are definitely on. So wait, what, what's happened then? I reckon they just done a run out with the money. <laughs> what do you think? I'm the only other truck you are, aren't they? Yeah, yeah, everyone else is okay. It's just them. Cash point doesn't work either. There we that's uh, Halifax. Ooh, drama. Unfortunately, you've walked halfway down the high street and taken it to a phone shop where people sell phones. It makes it look so good. I appreciate it, was there? Oh my god, look at that picture. What the? That is pretty cool, huh? Although we can't see anything. That looks weird. Let's take a couple of pictures of that. All I'm going to say, mate, is yeah. next time, when you find somewhere, hand it in into the place where you found it, because they have people that do that all the time. Then you brought, mate, you walk up and have a and it's your phone. I never like to find anything, you know, but <laughs> this time I found something, but you know, I'm not the one who take advantage. And I was feeling sorry for the reason. I was thinking to myself, if I would have lost, I would appreciate someone finding it. Yeah, that's where you handed it straight yeah. to the There's no okay, wise next time, What uh, we're saying uh, yeah. is, you've taken it away from yeah. the place where you found it, yeah, and yeah, handed yeah, it into somewhere where they can sell, where they yeah, sell phones. Yeah. The that's what I'm yeah. saying, is that's why we're giving you advice for next time. I apologise. To not to do it. That's fine, that's why we're doing this, okay? Are you okay? Yeah, hey, hey. What's he done? What's the matter, mate? Not a lot. I can't tell you. If he wants to tell you, I can I heard the rest of it. You find a phone? We're not well. I, I can't talk to you about that. I heard rest whatever, of it. Whatever, really. whatever you've heard. Yeah. Yeah. Sounds I, like I, a, I can't talk about. It. Sounds like a genuine mi business. Sounds like a genuine mistake. Anyway. Potentially, it is. Yeah, that's why we're giving him. That's why we're giving him some advice. Oh, cool, cool. So it wouldn't show up in a DVD, okay? But it may be disclosed if an application for an enhanced DVD. Okay. 
Yeah, but it was necessary because you know the situation. This is literally the lowest level we can do. This is what I say. Uh, I don't feel uh, guilty of anything. I just try to. Oh no, they're doing him over. It's all. Yeah, yeah, because I was being so stuck. That's why I appreciate that. That's, that's why, that's why we're dealing with it here. That's why we're speaking to you here and dealing with it. Yeah? This is literally. I just want you to understand. Yeah, yeah, we understand, mate. Do you understand it won't be on the police? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What it is, I think. Yeah, yeah, no, no. But yeah, don't. I wouldn't sign that. I don't sign that. Ah. I know, I know. You're happy. You shouldn't make him sign that. Come on. Ay, ay, ay. It's getting your record. That's a, that's a genuine mistake. He found a phone. He probably walked away with it. Like, we're not going to discuss the details. Yeah, it? but you just made him sign that. I think. Listen, it, I appreciate mm. this is what you've heard from speaking yeah, yeah, speaking yeah. on the street. Yeah. However, you don't know the full yeah, story. Absolutely. I think okay. he fits on his right though. The next time you find something, just no, hand I was it. feeling more confident too because I know him. I yeah. Often go there. Oh, no, I know. I understand what you're saying. It's just because technically an offence has occurred because you've removed yeah. it off the premises. So this is like literally the lowest level thing we can do, and then that's the end of it. <clears throat> That's it. Well, my wedding was determined, so to give you. Right, are you going to go home now? You're going to go home now? Or where are you going? Yeah, yeah, because I want to relax. <laughs> Too much okay, stress, fine. I'm not used to these things. No, it's alright, mate. Okay. Yeah. I uh, really feel sorry for her. I'm not to give her. That's why we've spoken to the woman about it. She I was, was thinking, she was shaking up at the time, but it's fine. Okay. When they form, they yeah, give back. No, it's fine. We've spoken to the woman, she was shaking up on the top. I think she's, she's okay. She's fine. Okay. Alright, thank you. That's alright, have a good day, man. Well, if you need. Yeah, it's fine. If you need, if you need, that's fine. Just a piece of Gilbert. Piece of Gilbert. Alright. Yeah, it wasn't in your wallet, mate, so I don't know. No, I know. Okay. Have a chat with you. Do you want to have a chat with your mate about it? About where your driving license is? Did you give it to him? Yeah, no, maybe. Is it in the phone shop? No. Have a nice day, you got him over. Okay. Officer, officer, quick, quick, quick. You know, the same thing happened to me as well. Kind of, I found a phone in the street. Yeah. And yeah. Uh, I kind of took it with me. Yeah. And then eventually it rang and I told them, hello, oh, by the way, I found your phone and I gave it okay. back. So I, I'm not going to explain it fully now. Yeah, yeah. There is an offence called theft by finding. So if you don't make the appropriate steps to locate... How much time do you have? It's up, it's up to the police or the courts to decide, mate. I think he'd done him over. If he wants to complain about it, he can complain about it. It's up to him. I can't, you made him yeah. sign that piece of paper. I think he'd done him over. And he he, I heard him saying he's going to show in his uh, C. If he wants to make a complaint about it, he can make In his CRB it. as well. Wow, guys, come on. Yeah, so as much as them two police officers looked uh, polite and professional in front of the camera, but in reality, they are actually two PIGs, I'm telling you. Uh, he lied on front of the camera saying that they were giving him advice, where in reality they were giving him a caution. Uh, as soon as the, the police, uh, the, the female officer mentioned DBS, I knew exactly where they were up to. Uh, the reason for that, it's actually happened to one of my mates, uh, whether he signed a caution. He wasn't aware what he was doing at the time. He just signed it just to get rid of him on the spot. And uh, a year later, where he needed his DBS for, 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 for work purposes, uh, his life turned upside down. Uh, yeah, so, so I was quite fully aware of what they were doing. Uh, a police caution, as you can see here, it's, it's a formal warning given by the police to anyone more than 10 years old uh, who has admitted guilt. So they need to admit guilt. So for them to and then and then sign uh the reason i told them they're actually infringing on their uh, on his rights is because as, he, as, he, as you can read here it says there must be a reasonable suspicion blah 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 so you know we don't know about that uh the offender must admit that they are guilty of an offense i didn't hear the guy admitting anything like that the offender must understand the significance of a caution and give informed consent of being cautioned i didn't see any of this either now 
it could go either way. The guy, he might, he might, you know, he might work anywhere like where he doesn't need DBS, so it's not going to affect his life. But if it turns out that he needs it later in in life, you know, he he's going to be in serious, serious trouble. The officers did not explain anything to him. They just they told him it's a warning. Just sign here, sign here, and uh, yeah, it's I thought it's pretty disgusting, really. I think the form that they made him sign is this. As you can see, it's Thames Valley Police. And he says it clearly here. Please read the declaration below and make sure you understand it. Look at that. I have been informed before completion of this form of my rights at any time to consult and communicate with the solicitor and that free and independent legal advice is available blah blah blah. yeah sure so they made sure he read all of this in that one minute of the video of course not we just made him sign that quickly and uh, yeah not caring whether he's going to be in trouble later on in in time or not uh yeah uh i found this while i was browsing but I was uh, while I was browsing the internet, I found this. So if any of you's like got this problem where they signed a caution, uh, these solicitors they can actually help. It just explains it all. What does it mean to accept police caution? Do you have to sign a police caution? Can I have wrongly administered the police caution removed? So, yeah, so there's a number here to call if any of you is actually affected by a caution like that. And, uh, yeah, I thought that might be handy. Anyway, back to the video. Honestly, the guy got just got done over. He, he, clearly, he found a phone. Uh, I think it sounded like he was in McDonald's. Obviously, he kept it. He could have kept it until it rings and give it back. Which, uh, honestly, I, I, I've done that recently. Uh, I found a fan in the street. It was in the street, uh, not in the shop. Uh, it was in Halloween. And uh, yeah, I took it with me. Eventually the phone rang and my first thing is, hello, I found your phone. And uh, I hand it back. They done him over. They done him over. And they did, uh, I, think, uh, I think I know what they've done. What they made him sign. These are gifts. supposed to grab that like that though. Sorry? Why are you grabbing her? So you were grabbing the lady. So you were grabbing her. I was grabbing her? I think so, yeah. No. No? Did you record it? Yeah, I did. Check the video again. Yeah? You check didn't... the video. You need to check the video again. You didn't touch her, no? No, I didn't touch her. I didn't touch her. Okay. I was like this, yeah? Yeah, that's okay. <laughs> you, you were a bit aggressive then. Sorry? I was aggressive? A little bit. Do you think? Do you think? <laughs> Sorry? Do you think? Do you think? Do you think I was aggressive? Do I think? It was yeah. very nicely with, with I don't know. the girl. He looked a little bit if aggressive. If you don't know, me. check the video. You are recording, yeah? Check times, the video again. Watch for four times. Watch four times. Time. And after that, come in here and ask apologies. Check your own video. You want me to check four times? And who the heck are you? He's a security as well. He's like Rambo. Look at that. Are you a Rambo as well? We are. We all are Rambo. You're Rambos? Yes. Well, who are you then? Seriously? You don't need to know. What do you need? You work for the council or? Yeah. I don't need to tell you. Oh, I will find out. What the heck was that all about? I don't know. He's trying to take... What did he work for? I need to find out.
So you work here? Do you work here, my friend? I don't need to tell you anything. I'll find out. I don't need to. You want to come with me? Come follow me, no problem. Yeah, go then. I just need to know where you work here. Because I think you're assaulted that lady. That's fine. So where do you work? Prove it. What do you mean? You have a video of prove it. So what did she do, seriously? Did you, did you see that? I don't know, I just saw a bottle, bottle fly and it nearly hit me, to be honest. Some oh, glass nearly hit me. You were standing here, she heard over there. No, no, the glass when it splattered. <laughs> yeah. So I need to ask, what's happened? I don't need to tell you. You don't need to tell me? Yeah. Right. Oh, there you go. I will find out who them are. So I guess you work with them, yeah? Council. Towns Warden. Hey, do, 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 do you guys have numbers? Warden. Do you have like a number? No? Sorry? Do you have like a number that I can uh, relate to? Why? Because I need it, because I witnessed something. Witness. Well, I don't need to tell you that. So if I want to complain about you guys to the council, which I think you work for the council. Twelve towns. They don't have numbers? They have them, bro. Yeah, but I need your numbers, no? I'm trying to find that lady that you abused. Ask her what you've done to her. What what did, uh, just I want to ask her what you've done to her. Ask her what we've she done wants to, to talk. Her. Ask her what we've done to her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, is that okay to ask her or not? Yeah. <laughs> Where are you guys going now? McDonald's? I don't know. They were, they were. Who are they? Like that. I saw them bullying some, fake, some lady. Fucking fake shit, man. Bullshit. Yeah. Bullshit. Bullshit. Like community support. They think they are, but they're nothing. They're nothing. They, they could, we could do what they do. You understand? Like, yeah, we can do better. Civil arrest. Civil yeah. arrest. You yeah. understand? If someone grabs someone's purse, I grab you. It's the same thing, brother. Come yeah, on. Yeah, man. that's right. But they have no authority. There's nothing. Peace, man. Peace, my brother. Have a good one. Yeah? You too. Yeah. Uh, well, that chaps a deal. <laughs> They have no authority. I don't know. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I was just standing, and uh, the next thing I see, a bottle coming towards me. And uh, that's that. Lovely slow. Slow is <laughs> a terrible place. Terrible! Uh, excuse me, PCSO. Excuse me. Quick question. Yeah. Uh, I'm trying to find out who these guys are. Do you know them? I mean, one so, of them. Could you just enlarge the picture? I don't know if I can. You can hold it for it. You can hold the phone. No, yeah, unfortunately, no. I mean, no. they were acting like. Uh, he's a security. Yeah, yeah, I could see that. Yeah, but no, I mean, I did not know him. No. This one was acting like Rombo in okay. town, and this one he thought he was the Terminator. Oh right. <laughs> and uh, I've asked him, uh, especially this one, because uh, yeah. it appeared like they were abusing. Oh, I don't know. It appeared like they were fighting with this woman. Oh, okay, I see. And. Uh, it looked like they were working for the council, like some kind of wardens. Ah, uh, but um, Liam, yeah. he definitely is a security. You wouldn't know this guy? But, nah, he might, nah, I wouldn't know him, no. He doesn't uh, work for the council? No, um, not that I'm familiar with. He might, but I don't know, no. I thought you were the sheriff in town. <laughs> well, Trust him, me, these, these two are running the him, town. I've seen him before, but not him. Never? Yeah, nah, not him. Yeah, that's the one I'm concerned about, this one. Okay, yeah, nah, Very concerning, him. because the way... Yeah. Uh, he was treating this lady was very yeah. bad and I wanted that I asked him are you like you work for, for the council he said I'm not telling you okay I asked you, do you yeah. have like well, service if he works for the council then he should tell you he's he didn't a, what, did he have any badge on him any lady no that's that what I'm saying he had there was another female yeah that she had like a blue uh, how do you call it blue vest okay and okay. I think that's definitely council isn't it yeah 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 that's the slab bead wardens they were so walking together all the way 
Yeah. But uh, I don't know if he's an SAA licensed or council. Uh, yeah, so the ones we, you saw with the blue uh, vest and all, yeah, they're yeah. SAA uh, licensed, but they work for the council. So the, the town centre one is not. Oh, it's okay, but you've never seen this? Yeah, no, I'm not, I'm not the one in uh, the black chap. Trust me, it. this guy, he thinks he runs the town. Okay, if I see him later on, we'll never go back because I'm literally just going for a quick uh, uh, break and all. No, no if worries, no worries. I'll around, uh, have a chat with him and see what's going on. No worries, uh, PCSL. No worries. You take care. So very polite PCSO there. Very polite. There's no need to ask him all his details and all that. But yeah, I think somebody's running the town instead of him. <laughs> Dude, look at the dirt. Don't know why, but Roy made a size, did you? I mean, I know some of it is outside, and why? Dude, that's filthy. Absolutely filthy. Hey, police car there. Eh? We called them already. So yeah, as I was saying, uh, Roy Mail sides, they're always filthy. I mean, it's not just the outside. Look at the inside as well. Just, they're just filthy. You know, knowing they actually handle all our mail, it's just, honestly, before you open your letters, I think you need to sanitize them quick. They're filthy animals. <laughs> anyway, I'm just gonna go all the way around. Yeah, see what happens. Sorry? Are you with BT or? No, 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 I'm not. It's just you're taking pictures of everywhere. We just want to Oh, to uh, yeah, yeah. For what reason? Who are you? I work for Royal Mail in the security side. I'm just oh. asking what's, why you're taking pictures of our site. This is a private area. Which one? This. Do you own this? Yes, it's private. You own this? No, this is owned by BT and us. It's joint ownership. Well, this drive here? Yes. From right from the front gates right through here is private property. So you mean you share the access? We share the access. All right, cool. Okay, so I just okay. need to wonder why you were taking pictures of the area, that's all. Just uh, present yourself, who are you again? I work for Royal Mail, my name is Malcolm Fishbourne. Oh, you work for Royal Mail? Side. Oh, yeah, yeah. What it is, I'm just filming around Royal Mail today. What for? Uh, just, uh, just to see how you guys operate. For where are you from? So which company? Where am I from? Yeah, which Originally company? Originally from Asgard. Which company are you working for? I don't have a company. So, what's the reason for filming? It sounds like, a, it sounds like an interrogation. Maybe. Well, it is a bit because... We're it gonna, is? It is a slightly interrogation because... Oh, I, really? If, if that's what you want to call it, I'm asking the questions because I need to understand why you're taking pictures of our property, which is a private property. I don't need to understand anything, to be honest. Okay, I'll, I'll, that's fine. I'll just give him a, a ring to the police and that's Ooh. him. Go! Whoa, 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 whoa! Wait! Where are you going? Don't call the police, man. Calling the police. So, uh, yeah. There is a, a gate at the bottom. Uh, I don't think this is his property, to be honest. Even if it is, I don't really care. 
Oh yeah, the police are still there. So that's a, that's a private house. God knows what they're doing in there. Anyway. Uh, there's two traffic wardens. Traffic wardens in Salah are like... There's more of them than cars, honestly. Look at them. So yeah, uh, well, tires everywhere. This is just beautiful, beautiful. Hello, sir. How you doing? You anything? Huh? Is there any problem? No, 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 just checking. Checking how you're handling our mail. Oh, very good, very good. <laughs> the guy in the van was sweating. Yeah, I'm not sure what this building here on the right hand side is. It's very secure, but it doesn't say what it is. Uh, yeah, it's very strange. Uh, why, the question is, why is it so secure like that? I asked the guy there, I said, what's this building? He said, he doesn't know. He also asked uh, nicely to not put him online. So I said, yes. Of course, look at the state of this place. See this, this slag is just horrible. Whoa. I think these are just abandoned. I think so. I don't know. All I know is uh, nobody cares around here. Nobody cares. I guess that's probably going to be a restaurant. I bet my money is the restaurant from the front. Disgusting, man. Ooh, the side of you is sick to be honest. Ah. Somebody's got to be responsible with this private or there are people just tipping so like a Christmas tree there, sofas, just crap everywhere. So yeah, that's all you get in uh, Slough. Vultures <laughs> everywhere. Oh, he's done you over. You, get, you pack it on the, this thing. Uh, on the bus stop. On the bus stop. So yeah, uh, this is uh, my day in uh, Slough. That's all I'll uh, finish on a good note. In a clean area. <laughs> As you can see here. Uh, it all looks nice and posh around here. As soon as you go to the... Ooh, there's them two police officers again. Yeah, as I was saying, uh, as soon as you go to the... The town centre is just a tip. It is what it is. Uh, no, it's not them, uh, the same officers. I think there's two different officers. Who cares? Anyway. Maybe. Out. Hey, sorry, lady. Can, yeah. can, can I ask you? you know, I, I saw that idiot. You're fast, what, What's happened? Can I, I, mean, I took a bottle of fucking wine. What do you mean you took it? I took it. I nicked it. Oh. But then fucking, you know what I mean? I was like, fuck it. You want it? And smashed it. 